Camila Valiva is at the center of a doping row which has engulfed the Winter Olympics after testing positive for the banned substance trimetazidine. The 15-year-old Russian figure skater has now been cleared to continue competing at Beijing 2022 despite her positive test following an appeal. It means she can take part in the women's singles event as part of the ROC, Russian Olympic Committee, under the agreement that allows Russia's athletes to enter despite country's Olympic doping ban. But what was the drug that Valiva actually tested positive for? Here's everything you need to know about trimetazidine. What is trimetazidine? Known as TMZ, trimetazidine is a drug used to treat angina and other heart-related conditions. It works by increasing blood flow to the heart and limiting rapid swings in blood pressure. Trimetazidine has been on the World Anti-Doping Agency's WADA, list of prohibited substances since 2014. The drug is currently categorized as hormone and metabolic modulator which is illegal for athletes to use both in and out of competition. Valiva tested positive for trimetazidine on 25th of December, photo, TAS slash giddy images TMZ is usually taken once or twice a day, and easy to detect in tests as a synthetic drug. It is believed that it can improve physical efficiency, especially in the case of endurance sports, although opinions vary on how long-lasting the effect could be. Dr. Kelly Johnson Arbor, a medical toxicology physician at MedStar Georgetown University Hospital, said the substance has the potential to improve athletic performance. She explained, if you're in a highly exertional sport, where you're using a lot of energy and you're putting your heart under significant stress, it certainly could help your heart function better theoretically. Which athletes have used trimetazidine? Valiva is not the first Russian athlete to test positive for the substance. In the 2018 Pyeongchang Winter Olympics, Russia's bobsledder Nadezhda Sergeyeva was disqualified two days before her race after testing positive for the drug. One of the most high-profile cases involving trimetazidine is that of Chinese star swimmer and Olympic gold medalist Sun Yang. More from Olympics he received a suspension in 2014 after testing positive for the drug, and said he was prescribed it to treat his chest pains. TMZ is an example of a metabolic modulator similar to meldonium, which has featured in other allegations against Russian sportspeople for doping. In the Pyeongchang Games, Russia's curling athlete Alexander Krushelnikiai handed back his bronze medal after testing positive for meldonium. Russian tennis player Maria Sharapova was banned for 15 months after testing positive for meldonium in 2016. Why is Camilla Valiva allowed to compete at Beijing 2022? Valiva, who tested positive for trimetazidine on 25th of December, has been cleared to compete despite the protests of WADA and the International Olympic Committee, IOC.